Hey guys, it's Dragon McGuire here. How you all doing? Today I'm going to talk about D Wade. If you don't know about Dwayne Wade, he went to the Bulls, and that's good um, and bad at the same time. I mean, it's good for the Bulls because that, uh, because Dwayne Wade is a good player. <sighs> the bad thing is that he's old, so. Basically, he's washed up already, and I mean, we can still use him, which is cool. We could still use him, and uh, but he won't play as much because he's so old. And yeah, so I don't know. Is this a good pickup? Yeah, it's good. Will the Bulls probably be good? Maybe I don't know yet because it depends how June Butler plays. It also depends on how Dwayne Wade plays and all the other players that um we have. But we also lost Mike Dunleavy. Yeah, we also lost uh, Mike Dunleavy. He went to the uh, Cavaliers, which is fine. Mike Dunleavy he was a good player. Um. Yeah, he was good. I wish we didn't get rid of him, but, you know, that was just a sign, Dwayne Wade, you know. And what happened was, I think, uh, he, um, the owner of the Heat, which is, uh, Pat O'Reilly, I think it is. Pat O'Reilly, if I'm not right, some of you correct me in the comments, but Pat O'Reilly is the owner of the, the Heat, and... I guess they couldn't agree to a deal. Dwayne Wayne said, like, oh, I want $25 million. How is it fair that all these other players, like Mike Connolly, <sighs> Mike Connolly um, and all these other guys uh, get all this money, and I'm a superstar, and I'm not getting that money. So do I think he deserved that money? Yes, I think he deserves it more than Mike Connolly did, but... Whatever, but what I see is Mike Conley's a young player, so I don't know. Um, but it's just crazy that Bulls got Dwayne Wade because I thought they wouldn't get him. I thought the Heat would sign him, or Cavs would get him, um, or something else would happen with them, which would be fine. I mean, am I happy that we got Dwayne Wade? Yeah. He's home. He's from Chicago, so that's cool. He's yeah, so he's from Chicago, which is cool, and all that. Um, and I hope he brings a championship next year. But I don't see the Bulls doing that, even with this addition. Now they could add other players and maybe have a chance, but they have to go through the Warriors, who have Kevin Durant, and they have to go through. The Cavaliers, who have dual, uh, LeBron James, and they added, oh, Mike Dunleavy, and they have another guy that they added. Uh, but also, I heard that Ray Allen might go to the Warriors, too, so that would be absolutely crazy. Like, to have one of the best three point shooters of all time with Curry and Clay Thompson. And Kevin Durant and uh, Draymond Green and Iguodala and and I could go on and on, but for real though, that would make that team impossible to beat. If Ray Allen joins the Warriors, that would be the craziest team of all time. And this year was a crazy team; they just couldn't finish it. But yeah, Dwayne Wade, he's going to the Heat. I don't or to the Bulls. I don't see the Bulls going anywhere still. But yeah, hopefully they do. Maybe I'm wrong. It's cool to see him in a Bulls uniform. I'm glad he's home. I wish he would have came home earlier. Maybe he should have came home in like 2010 when uh, when when Rose was here. Because if he came home then, I think we would have probably had a chance to win the championship. And that would have took the load off of, you know, Rose a lot of the time. But we'll see how it works. Um, you never know. Anything can happen. So, yeah, guys, that's my thoughts on D Wade uh, coming to the Bulls. So, yeah, guys, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and yeah.
share on social medias. Press the eye to watch more videos. This is Rock Gordy. I love you guys. Peace the fuck.